Hello, children. God bless all of you. And where could Abby be? Abby, I'm here. Oh, there you are. Hello, kids. Hello, Wes. Hello, Abby. Where were you? What were you doing? I was practicing. You know, I'm going to my aunt's house. And over there, I'll be with some of my friends. Mm. And we're going to play the handkerchief. And we're going to play musical chairs. And I want to win all of the games. Wow. Everything you just said is great, Abby. It's good when we share and play with other friends and when we participate in different activities. But what's most important is to play well and cooperate with others. Even when we're not the ones who are winning, we should be happy for others when they win. Ah, you're right, Wes. I'll enjoy playing and have a good time with my friends over there. That's great. And what are you going to do to practice? Tell me, what's the plan? I'll tell you. The first thing I'm doing is learning to run really quickly. That way, I'll be speedier. Playing is one of the things that we kids like to do best. When we play, we learn how to share and to get along with other children. When we play, it's always good to follow the rules and to let others join in. We also learn when we cooperate with others. If someone falls, we help them get up again. We should share our toys and we should also invite someone to play when they're on their own. Playing is good for having fun and for having a good time with friends. It's very good to know the Word of God. Will you join me and memorize this verse from the Bible? Perfect! Follow the hive and repeat it with me. Today's verse is in... Romans chapter 14, verse 19. Let us therefore make every effort to do what leads to peace and to mutual edification. Let's do it again. Romans chapter 14, verse 19. Let us therefore make every effort to do what leads to peace and to mutual edification. You're doing so well. Let's do it again. Romans chapter 14, verse 19. Let us therefore make every effort to do what leads to peace and to mutual edification. Now, try it by yourselves. Excellent! One more time, repeat it with me. Romans chapter 14, verse 19. Let us therefore make every effort to do what leads to peace and to mutual edification. I'm so glad that you learned a verse from the Word of God with me. Now it will remain on your mind and in your heart. Crafts. Hello kids, how are you? God bless you all. I want to welcome you to craft time. Today, we have a really fun board game, which is called Tic Tac Toe. And you guys can play it with your friends and your family members. So I hope you like it. Now let's see how to make it. All right kids, the materials that we're going to use to make our Tic Tac Toe are a ruler, a pair of scissors, but remember, you have to use them with adult supervision. A marker, a pencil, 
white craft glue, and foam sheets. Kids, in this case, I've used a blue, a yellow, and a green because I love those colors. But you guys can use other colors if you would like to. All right, kids. The first thing that we're going to do is to make a circle on our blue foam sheet. Good job. So after we make our little circle, we're going to cut it out. But remember, we're going to cut it out with help and supervision from a grown-up. We're going to make five circles. All right, kids, I have my first circle right here. But remember that we're going to make five. After that, we're going to make five X's. And now, let's cut two strips from our yellow foam sheet. Good job! Now, with the help of our craft glue, we're going to make an X. Remember, we're going to make five X's and five circles. All right, kids, now that I have my five X's and my five circles finished and dried, what we're going to do now is make our game board with our green foam sheet. And the first thing we're going to do is make two lines. Two vertical lines and two horizontal lines. Look how it's turning out. Now we're going to use our marker to retrace the lines we made. Two horizontal lines. All right, now that our game board is finished, it's time to play. So the rules of the game are, the player who has three matching shapes on the same line is the one who will be the winner. So here, the winner was the X. You can also play this game at home. I hope that you had fun. See you soon. And you guys, do you like to play with new friends? I really love to. That way, I can have lots of friends to play with. Yeah, Wes, you're right. I'll go to my aunt's house and I'll have a good time with all of the children there. That's great, Abby. I hope you enjoy yourself. Have a good time. Goodbye, Wes. Goodbye, I'll see you Abby. Later. What drawing should we color today? A park slide. Park slides are so much fun. Help me choose the pretty colors for this drawing. Let's begin by choosing a color for the slide. What color should it be? Good job! Now, let's color the tubes that hold up the slide. Perfect! Now, how about if we color the boys' clothes? That's looking really nice. Let's choose a color to paint the sky. We just need the grass now. Choose a color. Great job! I really like the way it turned out. It's always so much fun to play. I really liked coloring with you guys. It's one of my favorite games. You can continue coloring. I'm going to show the other bees 
this pretty drawing that we made together. Wes, hello, I'm back. Abby, you're here. You flew by so quickly that I didn't even realize. It's because my wings are flying faster now, Wes. So tell me, how did it go? I had a great time, Wes. There were a lot of new friends. My aunt taught us the rules for each game. We waited our turns and we played. We helped anyone who didn't understand the game and we all cooperated. It was so much fun. That's great, Abby. It's really important that you guys play and have fun. But what's most important is that you always cooperate and respect everyone else. That way the game will go smoothly. Wes, I won some candies and I brought one for you. <gasps> Abby, thank you. Oh, how sweet. Thank you very much, Abby. my friends, can you help me review what we've learned today? Excellent! Thanks so much! How can we play well with others? By pushing others? By waiting our turn? By cheating? By waiting our turn! Good job! To enjoy playing games, what should we do? Always win? Enjoy ourselves with everyone else? Throw our toys? Enjoy ourselves with everyone else! Excellent answer! What helps us to play well with others? To get along well with others? Does it help us to fight with others? Does it help us to follow the rules? Yes! To follow the rules! Perfect! You are some very wise children. See you again. Goodbye! That's all for today, my friends. We've all learned how important it is to cooperate, play well, and to always respect others. From now on, I'll play well, and I'll be thankful for all of my friends. Goodbye, See my friends. See you next time.